Hey y'all, good morning, LA Appliance Guy here. Before the video starts, I wanted to say thank y'all for hitting that sub button and subscribing to the channel and all the comments and likes. Uh, and thank you to all the veterans and I hope y'all have a safe and happy Veterans Day. Thanks for your sacrifice for this country. Um, yeah, my reloading bench is about as organized as my toolbox at, at the shop. <laughs> But thank you guys so much and thanks Retire on Dividends and the Retire on Dividends community for pushing me over that uh, limit, that thousand sub limit uh, yesterday. Y'all rock. On to the video. My favorite. Good afternoon, y'all. LA Appliance Guy here. I got in two ropers. VM indirect drive let's do a comparison all right so the vm washer got suspension rods the direct drive right there is getting dog ears so i got the cabinet off the direct drive and i'm gonna bypass the lid switch and i'm gonna put a jumper in there to jump the lid i've already put suspension rods on this and there's no codes and recalibrated and this one just needs dog gears and we're gonna compare the two and see what they do just like apples for apples newer roper older roper I don't know something fun all right we got the two blankets they're both about the same size we'll put that in there and then we'll put this one in the direct drive and we'll put one towel one towel and a little bitty small one and another small one okay so about the same loads all right we're gonna do deep water and warm and start deep water warm and start okay let's see what they do it's 12 33 oh, so that is deep water that is super I started it over here at heavy and I put this one on regular so that just does not look right that looks right So, to recap, Roper, VM, bouncy, through the off-balance code, put new suspension rods on, recalibrated, and that's what you get. Roper, direct drive, working, just needed dog ears. Dog ears is what ratchets the agitator. Which one are you taking? Draining, going into rinse. Still doing its little wash. Woo! 12.57, made it through rinse. Oh, looky there. It locked and it's draining. Going into rinse. Shoo! It's catching up. There it goes. Good job, VM. 
some of these old direct drives used to, they started putting two pressure switches up there for that low rinse junk. And I used to just jack them up because they just do a better job when you actually get water. All right, this one's doing its rinse. Water looks good and clear, except for whatever that is. This one's slowing down. It's gonna do its little drip, drip, drip rinse, I bet. We'll see. Yep, there it goes. All right. Just after one. I have to say though, if this thing was to put an actual deep water in there, it would have been much slower. But that's not enough water. Look at it. Going into final spin, beating the direct drive. But did it clean? I guess it did. But she was shaking. Snapping her fingers. Y'all didn't know LA Appliance Guy could sing. All right. Direct Drive has finished up its wash and the rinse, and it's gonna drain. Oh, Shaky Shake is in its final spin. Who will win? Who will win? Should I reach up over here? and turn it faster. <laughs> oh, that's cheating. We don't cheat around here. Come on, direct drive. Go, 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 go. All right. We're still waiting on the pause and the spin. There it is. It paused, now it should spin. Come on, come on. 10 minutes later. Ooh, that clutch don't seem very strong. Might have to put a clutch on it. Oh no, the direct drive just started and the VM is slowing down. Come on. It's got a long way to go. There is no brakes on this, it just slows down. That's giving us an extra time. But my question is, is it, is it gonna go again or is it just gonna unlock? You gonna go again? Nope. Cycle complete. It beat the direct drive and it's like 110. Not too bad, not too bad. But. I am wondering though if a better uh, comparison would have been with the extra rinse because that thing, the direct drive, fills all the way up in rinse. Oh no. Okay, we're gonna max the VM out. So we got deep water, extra rinse, warm, and heavy. Let's see what it does. Direct drive, super, extra heavy. Let's see. Just after 1.30. All right. Starting, starting. My thoughts is that the direct drive does not have an extra rinse setting, but it fills all the way up during rinse. The other one just gives it a little trickle, trickle, trickle. So let's see what it does. So this one moved the basket and put a little bit of water in. There it goes, it's starting to go again. This one has just continued to fill. So let's see. really probably could just turn this one down to large or medium over here and it would probably be fine but we're gonna jack it up ah getting more water it moved over to wash 
now we've got water in there and it's like 139. I guess you have to put it over here for it to get actual deep water. The washer showdown. <laughs> <laughs> Say, well, that was a long pause. I guess if you really want these things to wash, you got to put it on deep water, extra rinse heavy. Still washing while this one's going into rinse. It is still washing. Good lord. Draining after the rinse. Man, this thing is still going. Good. I mean, heavy. It's heavy. Heavy. Man, I bet you that motor is hot as a firecracker because on these VMs, the motor does all the turning back and forth. On the direct drives, they turn one way constant to wash and then turn the other way constant to drain and spin. I bet you that motor is fire hot. Well, direct drive going into its final spin. It's about 209, 210. Finally, it's draining. Just after 211. Jeez. Heavy, brother. Heavy. Don't stick your hand in there. All right, it just locked. And we're moving. I mean, I guess it's just gonna do its little trickle rinse. That doesn't necessarily mean extra rinse. Huh, okay. You do your thing. Looks like the direct drive is almost done. The VM roper is slowing down. It's still in rinse. Okay, that was it for the direct drive. Whew, good, because I was getting tired of hearing that. Let's see what kind of extra rinse this thing has. Oh, there it goes. Is that extra? Or is that just normal little trickle rinse? Guess we'll find out. And that was right at about 2.15. Is that it? Hello? Oh. Man, this thing is taking forever. I guess it's actually gonna fill up and do a little rinse. Good Lord. This thing is still filling and rinse. 15 minutes. Jeez, I guess heavy, you actually get a full rinse. Finally going into final spin. There it goes. And that's it at 316. Wow. Well, I can honestly say that I am never running that again. Left, right, 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 left, right. No codes. Wow. A lot of my cleaning goes on after the video is over. This one was like so caked up with build up right here. I had to like SOS pad it, but I don't show a lot of it, but I'll start to show, you know, more of the cleaning side. I just see so much of this crap every day. I'm kind of blind to it, but I'll try and do better.
thank y'all for watching and keeping me on my game. I'll start to do better with the cleaning and filming of it. Thanks. Okay, sorry, that took way longer than expected. I mean, wow, that heavy was heavy, brother. That was like super heavy, brother. Jeez. But that was an old school direct drive with the motor coupler mounted right to the transmission. So it washes one direction to wash constantly. The VM, it, uh, it, the motor does all the work. So it's a much slower wash. Uh, so I guess when you put it on heavy, it washes for a while. Um, but yeah, I will not be running that cycle ever again. Thank y'all for watching. And if you made it all the way to the end of the video, just the key word, if you want to prove it, is never again. <laughs> no extra rinse. I mean, wow. No friggin' extra rinse. Uh, but thank y'all for watching. We are almost to 1,000. I mean, way before Thanksgiving, I thought it would take way longer. But uh, we need like 40 something more subscribers. So if you haven't done it already, hit that subscribe button. Let's go. Uh, see y'all on the next one. Y'all have a great day. Bye. No extra friggin' rinse. That was way too long. Thanks for watching.